Hi, I'm Basha, and today we're cooking with Krakus ham. Poland on a Plate is brought to you by Krakus. Krakus, the true imported Polish ham. Today we're having fun with a Krakus mac and cheese station. We're going to be preparing a basic macaroni and cheese with Krakus reduced sodium ham, and then there's going to be a bunch of different toppings so everyone can style it to their own personal taste. I'm going to start by shredding cheese. I always like to shred my cheese from the block. If you're buying pre-shredded cheese, they actually put in like a wood component to keep it from clumping. Then you're gonna prep all of the ingredients for your mac and cheese station. So I'm gonna be doing the yellow bell pepper here, tomatoes, I'm gonna be doing red onion. When I go to Julasco, I always ask for Krakus ham and I have the deli guy give me a block of it so I can take it home and cube it later. Works great for a lot of recipes, especially this one. So then once all of your ingredients are prepped, you are ready to go. We're gonna start with a saucepan over like medium heat, add a couple tablespoons of butter to that. I'm gonna smash a clove of garlic to open it up and then when it's in the butter, it'll kind of infuse it with that garlic flavor. And I'm gonna take it out after a couple minutes so then there isn't garlic in our final dish. Now that I'm gonna take my garlic out, we're gonna add cream. So I'm using a light cream, about a cup. Pour that in, I'll allow it to heat through so that our cheese melts better. The cheese today, I'm doing a combo. So I'm gonna add, I have the fontina and the cheddar that I shredded already, allow that to kind of melt. And then I'm gonna take my goat cheese and just crumble it on top. And the goat cheese is really fun. It adds like a little bit of a kick to it. Just kind of stir it to combine it. Make sure that all the cheeses melt. Careful not to over stir it. When you're using this much cheese, it can get like really kind of congealed. And I have some cavatappi pasta that I've boiled. I really like this because it's kind of like even longer, more elegant elbow style. So I'm adding that to a bowl. I'm gonna pour our cheese sauce right on top, mix it to combine. Our mac and cheese base is done now. So to that, I'm gonna add our ham. I'm using Krakus reduced sodium. Could also use their original or honey ham varieties. Now we're ready to build our mac and cheese station. So just put everything out that you would ever want in a mac and cheese and let your guests have fun with it. For fun, I'm gonna show you how to make my favorite. So I'm gonna be taking our mac and cheese with Krakus ham, adding to it some broccoli, bacon crumbles, and some chives. And this is my Krakus mac and cheese station. You can find this and other great recipes on our website at polandonaplate.com and krakusfoods.com. Bon appetit, or as we say in Polish, smacznego.